Peter Stastny on February 11th of 89 against Pittsburgh. 8-1 victory over the Pittsburgh. Raglan. Little fight by Belarchuk. Oh, who is hit hard as Raglan went down. And Bodger and Tanny cover up and put a stranglehold on to Raglan as Malarchuk just had it. Finn just jumped right in there. Everybody has to take a man here and make sure you have him. Malarchuk wants back in there. The referee has a hold of Malarchuk right now. Malarchuk's getting a hold of, I believe it's Sackett very possibly has a hold of. Well, Jim Pizzatelli, believe it or not, is out of the ice surface. He went to attend to Malarchuk, who was hit pretty hard. And now we've got a fight going on with some fans. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to tell you. They some, jumped over the glass. Some fan went right over the glass. Oh, no. They oh, got dear. a hold of him in the bench. He has no a, business oh, being oh, there. Oh, look at Rob Ray. My God. He climbed over the glass. And I'm going to tell you, it's a high piece of glass as well. I don't know if we covered that in the backtrack again to let the fans know that there was a fan who scaled a pretty high piece of glass behind the Sabres bench and jumped right into a host of Sabres who I would say conservatively yeah. Rob Ray must have hit him about 47 times. <laughs> Well, there's another part. There's, there's a glass right there John was talking about that he had a scale. I mean, you had to be a mountain climber to get over top of that. So what are you going to do when he jumps in there? Obviously, he's going in there for a reason. I think at that point, it's better to give than to receive. There's Clint Millard chucking. I think the fan didn't have any business being there. The 21-year-old man apparently jumped on the ice to challenge the Sabres on a bet with a friend, but the victim, apparently realizing his error, did not file charges. The bizarre incident happened after Clint Malarchuk, you see, was submarine late in the game, so the fan jumped on the ice and challenged the bench. As you can see, four players uh, held him while Rob Ray landed some punches. Even Coach John Muckler and assistant John Van Boxmeer uh, were involved. But again, uh, in my opinion, uh, any person charging the bench gets whatever uh, he gets, so we'll see what the NHL thinks about it.